the glory himself. You will never, ever get tired of these pictures. We're all Dangerous, Jorge Martin asks for Valentino Rossi's technique to be banned in MotoGP. Jorge Martin wants the technique created by Valentino Rossi to be banned or prohibited from being used again in MotoGP racing. The technique created by Valentino Rossi that Jorge Martin refers to is the leg dangle or leg wave, where the rider extends his leg when braking hard. Jorge Martin said this in relation to when he was involved in a collision with Peko Begnaya at the start of the 2024 Malaysian MotoGP. While braking at turn one of the Sepang circuit, after the start of the race, Martin, who wanted to overtake from the inside, hit Bagnaya's leg, which was sticking out to the right. Luckily, the Ducati Lenovo team racer's leg was not crushed, because the impact immediately caused his leg to return to its original place. However, Martinator now feels that the leg stretching maneuver is very dangerous to do in a MotoGP race. What is unique is that the racer with number 89 himself often makes this movement like other racers, including when his front wheel hits his main rival's leg. Gave him some room, and uh, he didn't go straight ahead. You know, and missing those two things for me is what just kept it on the... We have to start banning the foot going out like that, because the fact is it's dangerous for both of us, said the leader of the standings, as reported by gridoto.com from Toto Circuito. On that practice session, I was not on the level on Q1. Um, need to understand the, the, the feeling with the, with the MotoGP bike because uh, it's a bit, uh, it's a bit There are moments where the bike in front sucks you in and then you the can't control it, Martin explained. Uh, it was 11th place for Mia, which was his best result of the season. His best since that fifth a strong ride in the uh, inaugural Indian Grand Prix. This leg dangle maneuver was first popularized by Rossi in 2005 when he beat Sete Gibernau in Jerez. At first, this move was considered strange and useless, until the doctor continued to use it and remained competitive. Eventually, other riders tried to copy this technique, and the benefits were very noticeable for maintaining balance under heavy braking. That's why, until now, racers continue to use this leg-stretching technique when braking and entering corners.